Hi guys, Andrea Mills here. Thanks for coming over today. I'm going to show you the um, system I use for keeping everyone's hangers organized in our closets. We have um, 10 people in our family and only three closets for everyone to share. So we have the one in Tom's in my bedroom and we have one in the boys' room and one in the girls' room. So Tom and I have clothes for the two of us in our closet, so it's two people. The girls' closet has the clothes for all three of our girls and then for our little guy Solomon his clothes are in there too just because I still help him get dressed and it's upstairs so I will keep his closet or his clothes up here where it's easier for me to get them out. So then the boys' closet in their room has the clothes for the other four big boys. And so since we're all sharing the same closets, um, I want to keep everybody, you know, organized by whose clothes are whose hanging up there. So we always organize everything by color and I used to buy colored plastic hangers for each one of the kids. So Thomas had blue hangers, Asher had purple hangers, Judah had red hangers, and so on. Um, I really liked that system, but it became more and more difficult for me to get hangers in the right color. By the time I got down to Solomon, who was our sixth, I had a super hard time finding green hangers. It just was something that was, you know, sometimes I'd luck out and all of a sudden, oh, there's some hangers that I need, but sometimes it was very difficult and they just get broken over time and need to be replaced. And so I decided I needed to come up with a different system that was easily um, that I could easily add to as I needed more hangers so if I had been smart I would have thought of what Nikki over at a farmhouse folded she just used all white plastic hangers and did um, the colorful masking tape so she just put a little piece of tape on each hanger to indicate whose is whose I didn't think of that so um, the other thing was that I had decided I wanted to start using those little velvet hangers I had seen some of those on some organizing videos and I thought oh that's really nice how they hold the clothes really well it is kind of annoying because you can't just pull on a shirt and pull it off it doesn't slide which is good because the clothes don't fall off the hangers but it can be it took a little while I guess to get used to the difference and how it felt with the hanging up the clothes and pulling them off the hangers but we're totally used to it now and um, we have two sizes of hangers I use the adult size velvet hangers for um, everyone from justice up so he's eight so for his clothes on up have the adult size hangers and then from Eden down she's six they we use the baby size of the velvet hangers and I got mine on Amazon I think I want to say that they were I don't know I get them in boxes for like 25 for like 20 to 25 dollars I can't remember exactly how much it is but um, they're not that expensive and every year or so I buy a new box to um, keep to replenish things that have gotten broken and or you know we have been adding a few new colors into our rotation of clothes that we wear so I need to have new hangers there so today I was actually putting some new um, get some new hangers ready for the closets so I thought I would go ahead and just show you what I do use these are little um, those little clippy things that you get like you'll see them at um, retail stores and they'll have the size markers on them but these ones don't have anything written on them they're just plain but they're in all the different colors so Tom has black I have pink and then the kids are all in their colors that we use to organize so Thomas is blue Ash is purple Judah is red Justice is orange Eden is yellow and Solomon is green we ran out of colors so we started back over with blue for Sophia and purple for Claudia and I got these off of eBay they were they're new and I bought them like a pack of a hundred for like two dollars although I just checked and the same place is now selling them for three dollars and seventy cents for a bag but for a bag of a hundred that's it's a lot of little markers and it'll take us a long time to go through all of them because they don't really they have little teeth in them that can break off but you can pop them on and off hangers without them breaking most of the time so then this is what our hangers actually look like this is one for each of us and um, you can see we have the adult size and the baby size and um, 
Yeah, so they're just all hanging up in the closets. And now, even though we have like a whole bunch of black shirts hanging together, each hanger has a different color on it. So everybody knows which shirt belongs to them when they go to get dressed in the morning. And I'm gonna try to show you one-handedly here how easy it is to put these on. So you just take it and you just slide that little thing through there and it just clicks right on and that is it. So I'm going to try to do a few more laundry videos coming up soon. We'll see how that goes. I always have high ambitions and sometimes things don't happen as quick as I think that they will, but that is my plan. So that is how we keep our closets organized and um, straight for everybody. So if you have not subscribed yet, I hope you will do that. If you want to see more videos on organizing for a large family, organizing a small house, homeschooling, um, home birth, making your own medicines, any number of things that we talk about, um, go ahead and click the subscribe button. If you, if you already are a subscriber, I really appreciate you stopping by today and having this conversation with me. And we will talk to you guys again very soon.